When an earthquake strikes, literally every second counts. That was the case five years ago, when a magnitude 9 quake unleashed a massive tsunami that devastated Japan. Since then, scientists have been working to improve detection systems in the hopes of generating more accurate earthquake data and ultimately buying people a bit more time to flee a soon-to-be disaster zone. Researchers are now tapping into a new pool of data. It turns out the technology in conventional seismological instrumentation exists in every smartphone on the planet. And so the idea is if we can harness the accelerometer in those smartphones, then we could collect massive amounts of data. It can really revolutionize how we understand earthquakes and earthquake effects. Earthquake, duck cover and hold on, strong shaking expected. Richard Allen and his team have developed a smartphone app called MyShake that's designed to monitor a phone's accelerometer data. He says accelerometers in phones are nowhere near as sensitive as conventional instrumentation, but what they lack in sensitivity, they make up for in numbers. Real-time data from phones could equate to more warning time. So the amount of warning time we might be talking about depends, of course, on where you are relative to the earthquake. But we're talking about seconds, tens of seconds. Best case scenario is a few minutes um, before an earthquake, tens of minutes potentially for tsunamis. Allen says many regions most prone to deadly earthquakes and tsunamis don't have reliable early warning systems. In those places, he says, this new source of data could prove to be a game changer. There's no seismic instrumentation. But if we, there are many, many smartphones often, and so if we can harness those smartphones, we could provide some form of warning in those countries. The app can be downloaded from the lab's website at myshake.berkeley.edu.